Eddie, convincing 4 0 victory. How are you and the rest of the squad feeling? I've not been in to see the, the squad yet, but no doubt they'll be elated the fact they've reached another Scottish Cup final. So, um, and the fact it's our fourth in a row just adds to um, a remarkable achievement. The game itself, can you talk us through it? How do you feel uh, your squad played? Are you pleased? Yeah, I think. Um, I certainly think the scoreline's far more convincing than probably anybody would have imagined. And um, I think managing to get an early goal and probably give us a wee bit of uh, foothold in the game. And the second one, I believe, obviously changes. It actually changes both half time team talks, there's no doubt about that. And going in at half time, 2 0 up, just 2 0 up with the, the second goal coming late. Uh, what, what were you saying uh, to the girls in terms of their strategy in the second half? Oh, it was just a case of making sure we kept the ball and were patient. Um, and, and we knew the next goal was going to be vital because if Hibs got it, then uh, it's a game back on again. If we got it effectively, the game's over and done with. So, uh, well, we had just had to have a strategy of not being uh, impatient and um, retaining good possession of the ball, and I felt we did that quite well. Had a fantastic season so far in terms of success and progression, such as the Champions League. I mean, what. What are you doing differently, or what, what would you say the squad are doing differently that's make, making them stand out? I think there's a, there's a number of things, there's not only one thing. Um, we've obviously got good players, there's no doubt about that, which is the biggest help in any manager's career. Um, I think there's a real focus and determination. There's good experience here, which helps because players have been over the course before, and young players that come into the squad, uh, they benefit from that experience of playing the players that have been there and done it, so um, I think that's probably the biggest thing that um, I would say has been the biggest thing for pushing forward, the fact that we are continue having success. Looking ahead to the final, um, and you know, obviously the squad have been there before, how much of an impact would it be to walk away champions again? Well, I think once you reach your final, and certainly at this club at all, um, in the past, we don't suffer many defeats, but when we do, we kind of respond pretty well. So, um, and that goes down to the fact that the players don't like losing here. Um, doesn't mean to say we're unbeatable. We are beatable. Everybody knows that. Um, we just hope that we can continue another season, and um, it would be, I mean, it would be three trebles on the bounce, which is just uh, ridiculous, to be honest. Um, so, but no, no, no matter what, the two teams that are about to play next. Uh, they'll be determined, the winners of that one will be determined to make sure it's maybe going to be their day. So um, we'll have to have a full focus on it. It's not ideal preparation, the fact that we'll be playing Champions League that midweek before the Scottish Cup final. So, But it is what it is and um, it means that we've been successful if we've got all these games.